impish importance. Interesting, okay. <clears throat> uh, you, my great stranger, must be an adventurer. You have found yourself in the company of. Yeah. Journalist for the. Yeah. A pleasure to make your acquaintance. Are you aware of the festivities currently on. Wait, festivities currently on way at the gold saucer they guarantee a generous mgp bonus to those who participate but i have reason to believe that there is more to the celebration than meets the eye as a writer for the premier publication on unexplained and otherworldly phenomenon i was drawn not to the promise of copious cat pods but to the rumors of enigmatic water imps that have suddenly proliferated Rated amongst the saucer's patrons. Uh, yeah. We at the thing have been looking to expand our investigation across the store, and this supernatural scoop presents us with it. I do a birthday day. day. Why have the imps made themselves known now? What do they intend to accomplish? I must cover this gun groundbreaking story with all due haste. But I cannot hope to answer all these questions alone. Tell me, Avenger, would you aid me in my pursuit of truth? Yeah, sure. Yeah. Excellent, excellent. Then let us reconvene at the Gold Saucer's entrance square. I know where that is. Hooray. Have you arrived? Notice anything out of the ordinary? Something green. Yeah. What did it just say to me? I think our creature is in costume. Yes. <laughs> Indeed. An imitation and nothing more. Bye. And here I thought I could rival the editor-in-chief with my own on something article now what I am I to pull apart this is the child's this is but child's play next to the discoveries he has made we have found the source of the rumors but saucer imps unmasked just normal men and women in costume why that sounds more to me like a waste of good ink <laughs> oh no oh no it's unacceptable worthless unfit for consumption oh Gods, I grow drowsy just thinking about writing such a thing. Our readership would be a bolt. <laughs> Fortunately, there is another curious lead that I wish to pursue. Um, in doing so, we may frame our story around the current festivals. Then recount the role of the imps within them. Yes, that might suffice. You see, as I waited around, I questioned the attendant at the front desk as to imps. Origin, strangely enough, I was told that that only a secret few staff members were present in the planning stages of this affair, and fewer still know who proposed the initial idea. <gasps> Conspiracy! Ah. It was, however, in front that a staff member on the floor, a man attending to an imp, may have the information we see. If we split up and search the saucer, we're bound to find him. Yay! I shall leave Wonder Square to you. Let us recommend here with our rounds are complete. Y'all, y'all, y'all. Y'all, bro. Well, man, my good man, my friend, and I are delighted to make your acquaintance. He cannot speak like you and I, but I assure you, he is oh so fun to make him new friends on this joyous, impish occasion. What is the occasion you ask? Why the march of the imps, of course. Tis a fresh new take on the, our annual celebration here at the Ghost of as suggested by one of our staff. When we first received word of it, we were rather baffled by the concept, but it seems to have left a positive impression on our guests. To present our patrons with the most 
engaged in experience possible. We are there are intended with impish attire, these costume and so free to frolic about the saucer and bring joy to those they meet. Lord Dobro Squee or La La. Why imps? One might ask, they, uh, and they would have good reason to do so. Alas, so my, myself was never told the exact reason. But if you came to learn more of the march, I know just the imp who can assist you. He's the one who coined the idea. For after all, I last saw him on the second floor on the lounge. He may still be there if you heard. If he should speak to you in an imp's tongue, you need fret. He's particularly unique even among his bre uh, brethren, and he makes his intentions quite clear to those not first to imp speak. Ha <laughs> ha. Yeah, okay, sure, bro. Sure. Oh, well, oh my god, we know who this is. It's Godbird. Who else could it be? <laughs> Though you feel as if there's been some great misunderstanding. The imposing imp suddenly entrusts you with a set of impish attire. His piercing gaze reaches into the very depths of your soul, and you somehow come to understand what he is trying to tell you. Go forth, my stalwart apprentice. <laughs> you have to sink in feeling that the imp will not provide you with the information you require until you have completed his task. It is now your solemn duty to don the impish attire and entertain the patrons in the vent square. Fuck no. You must go. Okay, fine. Speak with that and to store blunt. Okay. Ah, oh, shit. Well, shit, bro. <laughs> Judging by the exact attire, I'm going to assume you work here. Tell me what you have these attracting art stacked against me. I've lost nearly all my damn GP today, and I need to find a way to earn it back somehow. Uh. What is that your way of consoling me? As if I needed pity from an oversized frog. Oh! <coughs> so I appreciate the sentiment look. May not be on my side, but it's nice to know that someone else is. Check out! <laughs> wow, you're one of those new mascots. You must know all the prizes here, right? I saved up lots of MGP, but I'm not sure what to exchange it for. If only I could take you home with me. Oh my god, that's fucking what the fuck. Oh, I know. They have little imps that look just like you at the price counter. Yeah. I want uh, So let's go get one, please. Uh, 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 uh. Oh, hello there. You must be that, be that new mascot that's been marching about. Some manner of imp, was it? Why, like your hat? Head thing? Bleep, bleep, a frog. <laughs> oh my god. Oh shit, that's funny. Uh, I was a bit afraid to chat with you at first, but you're much friendlier than I imagined. First senior now you uh, what? Huh? Oh, first senior receptor now you uh would I have never had, had to leave this saucer. I could spend the rest of my days surrounded by a builder creature like you. Yeah, okay. Yeah, sure. Your impish antics have brought joy to the saucer patrons. Return to the opposing imp and inform him of your success. Yay! The opposing imp appears downcast, as if he was expecting someone else. Perhaps it would be best to remove your impish attire. Surprise! Oh. I don't get it.
in an ephemeral moment that the imposing MC case meets yours. You are overcome with a mysterious sense of obligation and realize what he is trying to tell you. Let us continue our discussion at Entrance Square. What the fuck? <laughs> Either you are loath, I am, am to admit, my search for the one behind this event has yielded little success. Regardless of my results, it's plain to see that the imps are well loved by all, but I cannot write an article on that fact alone. How did you fare my honorary assistant? Terrible. I knew it. I know that body anywhere. It says the place has always to see out the saucer roach. <sighs> the Godber Manaville? Never did I think I'd meet a member of the syndicate face to face. Surely of all people must know who proposed the idea for this event. Your generous deeds this day have not gone unnoticed, so I believe an explanation is in order. It was I who proposed the idea of these festivals, as a matter of fact. Why? No way! <laughs> Perhaps you are already aware, but we employ a voice sent known as Typhon here at the Ghost House. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Summoned into this world by the Black Mages. Uh, he has a soul who utilizes ornamental Fugas to our <laughs> patron's benefit. Yeah, totally. It was not long after I hired Master Typhon that I became acquainted with a high-ranking member of the guild, though through him I learned of a curious spell from ages past known only as Imp. True to its name, the spell transforms the target into the very being as you have aspired marching about the saucer. Master Uthuris is proficient in the very same spell. True, actually, yes. Wow. Lower accurate. Holy crap. Actually turns into an imp in one of the fucking fight mechanics. Annoyingly. But lore accurate. May I be so bad? <laughs> I just read that nice. Top the dragon's neck. Yeah. Yeah. He often refers to his imps as his buddies and pals. Did he say that? I don't remember. I don't, I don't read when I'm fighting. I found myself quite enamored with these adorable creatures and sought to answer the questions that yet lingered in my mind. Where did the imps come from, and how did their spell fall into the hands of man? Or baby. Ha <laughs> ha! Holy shit. I poured through what few resources were available on the subject, yet I could not find a definite answer. Heartbreaking though it was, I was left with no choice but to leave the creatures. Uh, lineage shrouded in mystery. Who the fuck? Ah! Oh! oh my god! My friend waved at me, I can't believe it. Damn it. And I can't do nothing about it torture uh but to leave the creatures learning a shroud in mystery nonetheless i couldn't not allow their history to fade into obscurity when it came time to decide the theme of our annual festival i crafted the impish attire based on my fightings and imposed a celebration in their honor <laughs> you utilize these customs not only to entertain but to educate others as well and with that the story is laid bare. Indeed, though I know not if such a conclusion will prove ideal for the truth thingy. I feel a story come on. Myth made manifest at the gold saucer. Black Mage's history reveals imps mystery. <gasps> Evil. Ha oh, yes. This is the scoop I seek. Yay. Hit me out. <laughs> is as Master Manerville says, much about these imps remains a enigma, but they have brought countless smiles to the gold sauce. Readers shall doubtless want to learn of their ex existence, as well as the event that brought these few facts to the l l wait, what? Wait, 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 wait. To the fore. I thought it was like lore, like what? Such passion and drive to shed light upon the unknown is a fascinating tale, one that I shall do my utmost to detect. Oh, ho! Oh. That's the spirit lad. To it be an honor to see your imps grace your publication pages. I shall look forward to reading your account of it in the coming days. Hey. Okay, yeah, yeah. This judgment story will doubtless bring all the more attention to the march of the imps, so I must express my thanks in the spirit of the celebration with a set of impish attire, of course. Fuck no! <laughs> 
Put this in the trash! <laughs> you have my deepest gratitude as well, adventurer, and inspiration calls, and I must a way to make these ideas a reality. But your contribution were vital to this discovery. You are more than deserving of reward. Uh, where is it? What up? I job well done, my friend. The fest festivities shall be underway for some time yet. So I hope you will not squander the opportunity to enjoy this moment of respite and march with our fellow imps. No. No. I'll just take the 50% and leave. Okay, bye. What? Oh. We're gonna fuck the Abigail girl. With that move. <laughs> okay, uh, looks like that's it. Ooh, come here, Hell yeah, bro, let's go. Oh. <laughs> uh, two, three. Man, fuck. Okay. Fuck no, man. Oh, God. Uh, yeah, it was, it was bad anyway. Whatever. Yeah, I'm putting this shit in the trash. Alright, there we go. Anyway, video over.